day. My name's David Troy, and this is the David Troy Salon. So in this video, I'm going to do a pixie haircut, and I'm going to make her quite a bit blonder. So, and I'm going to break the whole thing down for you. So let's just get started. So my choice of lightener is going to be the Synchro Lift by Paul Mitchell. But before we even start the blonde, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the number two clipper and just get rid of some of the excess first before we even start colouring. Because I want this to be a really short pixie rockstar haircut. Okay, when I use lightener, I always start at the front because we really do want that to be the blondest. But you can see the way I'm putting the colour on, I'm not painting it on, I'm dabbing it on just to make sure it completely covers and try not to overlap so we don't get any breakage. So I'm going to let this process for about 35 minutes and then I'm going to use the PM Shine 9V as my toner which I'm going to leave on for about 15 minutes. I love the way this colour is looking, it's turning out awesome. So let's just jump right into the haircut. I've already used the clippers on the back, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start right around or right above the occipital bone, and I'm going to take my sections uh, vertical and just connect that right where the curve of the head is on the occipital bone there. I'm just going to connect that to where I use the clippers underneath. It was a number two guard, so I was pretty short, so I'm going to take that pretty tight in the back. Okay, one thing I want to point out here, I always keep my sections really clean, but when I cut hair, I'm actually cutting when I pull the scissors back away, so I don't want to push the hair forward. It's important, you know, I've talked about this a lot in my videos, but it's very important to learn the proper way of actually closing your scissors, so you're cutting on the back stroke to oppose pushing the hair in a forward motion. So I'm just continuing taking diagonal forward sections, working my way around, just connecting. I've got a guideline that I'm following and I'm just slightly over directing the back just to make sure I keep a little bit of weight in the front so I can go back through it later. Now I'm just going to continue on to the other side. Okay, now I'm going to move on to the side of the head and I'm just going to take diagonal sections forward like I've been taking and just continue it all the way around. So you can see me constantly going over the hairline here on the side, just making sure it's clean up and over the ears. I love these pixie haircuts and if they're cut right, I really believe anyone can wear short hair if it's cut right. So now just moving on to the top, you can see what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull it straight up and I'm going to point cut this whole thing because um, I want the texture to be really choppy. So I don't want any straight lines across the top. You can see I'm just going through and point cutting everything. I'm slightly over directing it back again. And really this is just a safety net for me to keep a little bit of length. So I can go back through it later on when I dry it. I love this haircut and I even love the color. Look, if you like my videos, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you know when I upload next. Thank you. 